You may be wondering, how do I take apart these new urns that we have here at Cobb? Jackson, you probably don't know how to take apart this urn. Am I right? What do the we new do? Luxus. No idea. What do we do? All right. Well, I'll tell you guys how to do it. Because I figured it out one time by spending 15 minutes on it. Is this a Snapchat on. story? No. Oh. This is, first of all, there's this strainer thing in the way that actually collects coffee down here, and you can't like pour this shit out well without taking it out. So, go around back. Can you see that? No, wait, no, let's just rotate this. Let's rotate. Eugene just rotated this for us. Now, see how there's this button? Depress the button. Wait, wait, press it down. Literally press it down. Yeah. Now you can, while that button is depressed, Slide this up. Wow, that was Woo! easy. All right, next up, um, you want to go underneath and loosen this thing. You can't see it very well. Oh yes, uh, great. And here we're loosening it now. Not all the way, because it'll pop off. And slide out this plastic thing. Great. You can even rinse that off, or just put it into the dishwasher sink. Okay, right. next up, um, well, so, you want to remove this top part. As you can see, there's a label on top of here that says, do not submerge in water. There, it's in focus now. 45350, do not submerge in water. So remove that, just by lifting it up out of the thing. Great. Now, um, now just like... Oh yeah, get the coffee out of it, by not dumping it, because if you dump it, like you do with the old urns, from the top, shit just gets crazy, because there's so many compartments that fill up with, with coffee and water and things, so you have to just wait for it to filter out through that thing. And now, if you want it to stay, here's what you do, is you rotate it around so it says, in the front part, not FETCO, but do not serve or something, you see that? It says do not serve. Yes. And so now you just push that forward and it will stay. It doesn't lean. That's really irritating. Thanks, Fetco. Jesus. This is a, this is a very time intensive <laughs> part of the process. You could chat with your coworkers right now. Yeah, but there are no coworkers here. There's Tova. You can even wash out another urn as you are. Can I just can I just empty it? Like a regular urn now. Yeah, if there's a little bit left, I guess. Okay. Only thing is that they're like these weird ass compartments no, no. that fill up with water. I mean like can I can I start? Oh no, no, it's not finished yet. Oh no, okay, now we're Okay, here. now put this back. Right, rotate that again. Mm -hmm. And now and now like do the urn next shit. But the instruction video is not over. There's still much to Wait, I thought these things don't need Urnex, these new ones. What is the... What's the protocol? Urn cleaning. That did they do? So we have the the new Urnex need Urnex? Yeah. I thought we watched them without Urnex yesterday. It's not really a big deal. Okay, should I have... Alright, jump in the Urnex room. Alright, wait, 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 do you really put the Urnex in there? You put it in there? Uh, that's what I thought. Okay. But well, let's look confirm. Wait. You put that? Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Urnex goes in brew basket, right? Um, yes. Okay. Great. Okay. <laughs> I don't think it matters that much, but... Don't pour it in the hole. Don't pour it in the hole. Yeah, that's right. You'll see in a second. What's bigot? No, no, you don't. Boom. Make sure you're jamming out to like electro funk while you're. This is the best song on the album too. 
now do some other stuff in the meantime rock out a little bit Maybe wash sanitize dishes. some dishes yeah nobody is using these gloves oh oh my gosh PSA number two turn them inside out when you're done and like leave them on the sink because if you turn them inside out like right now if there's any liquid moisture at all on the inside of these gloves when you're finished with them or whatever it won't yeah, exactly. First, it was like, it, they already smell terrible. I don't even use gloves when I wash dishes. Well, you're not making the water hot enough then, because it should burn the hell out of you. No, I mean, I've just been washing dishes for so long. That I'm okay. Oh, seriously? Yeah. Oh, shit. Well, this guy's a veteran. Well, you're going to need the gloves in a second. You're going to seriously need the gloves when you, uh, for the next, this next part of the urine cleaning oh, process. For the urine yeah. Right. It gets really hot, it gets scalding hot. Look at this. Look at that. Look at that little burn on my hand. Woo! That hot. Working at a coffee shop is serious. Yeah, it's dangerous. Alright. Oh, wait. I'm just gonna. I'm sure it's nowhere near done. No, but I should probably empty some Oh, I didn't even do half batch. Isn't this a half batch? No, this is a full batch. In fact, this has more space than the other one, so I don't have to, you don't have to empty anything out for this. Not as good as this. Not as good as this bagel. <laughs> wow. What? It's it's got a kind of surrealist. It's like a surrealist take on an instructional video. I'm gonna do an unedited. Yeah. What? Yeah. Oh wait, here's another. Here's like a third PSA. Apart from me, this is the correct cap for this for this color sauce. Sometimes even when it says green on it, people put it on the red cap, which leaves this teensy tiny little opening through which to squeeze that chunky green chutney. It just doesn't work.
Run. It's instructional. There's no art. The final drop. What is it? Yeah, it's ridiculous. How is this not finished? Oh my god. Okay, it's done. Alright, Eugene. Yes. We're gonna need you to, to act out this instructional. Awesome. It's ready. Welcome back. What are we doing? Alright. What do we gotta do? Take this, take this burn. And uh, be very careful not to burn yourself by releasing some of the liquid inside. But take it and then move it over to the sink and you're gonna balance it on the corner of the sink. Okay. Wait, I gotta, gotta wait till that one's you know what? No, it's okay, you can do it. No, not that sink. Wait, it's fine, Eugene. The other sink. Yeah, yeah. The one you'll see. Okay. You'll be surprised. Oh well, no you won't, you'll just it'll just be fun. Alright. Now like balance it. Like put both one foot here and one foot here. Oh mount it. Alright. All right, now you're probably gonna want the glove unless you're like really like superhuman, unless you're made up of I don't know. Safety first. Right yeah. hand, left hand. Um. Right hand. All right, let's do this. Okay, so the way that this works is, um, you're going to first pull up on the tab right there. Okay. Well, actually, you can just do that right now. Well, first, well, you can't push it up. You have to pull it up. Or no, you can't push it up. I don't know. Just pull it up, I guess. Can you just pull up? Okay, so it's popped up. Wait, wait, let's get this like... Yeah, so this part is, pu is pushed up now. Yeah. And that means that you can take this and rotate it. <gasps> what the fuck? And so the issue is that there's a lot of like ground staying on the bottom of this, this canister. Right. Um, and there's a filter in this. Oh, uh, shit. So the, the grounds won't be able to come out unless you take this off. But the issue is that the urnex is fucking hot, and as soon as you remove this, it's going to come squirting out. Um... So like, just take no wait. This? Remove it with with the, the, the left hand, hand I think. Hand and yeah, and like get your hand out of there fast, and then it'll be like a peeing man. Just pull it out. Just pull it straight out. Straight forward. Yeah. Whoa. Yeah. And now it's a peeing. Look, you can like come up. You can like approach it from behind. Oh. 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 It's been a long day. Oh. All right. And you can also rinse out that um. Thing? Yeah, because there is a, there is a, whatchamacallit, a right. probably going to be grinds in there. Right. And there's also like this weird sticky that. adhesive. Where should I rinse it from? Top? Yeah. So it pushes the grinds out. And from the back too, I think, but I don't really know. But like, feel the, feel the, the uh, place where it attaches to the, 
to the urn, or the whatever this thing's letting us say. Like, feel it with your, your finger. Is it sticky? Yeah, it is. It's white, right? Yeah, like, so it's like wash that off a little bit. I'm sure it doesn't matter that much. This thing is still peeing. I'm pretty sure, like, you... Like, if... You could just dump it out, but it would just get... It would just... All these cavities at the top would fill up with water, and it's so freaking hot that you're gonna burn the hell out of yourself inevitably if you do that, like, without a doubt. This is so satisfying, anyway. Yeah. Back on there? Yes, well let it out, let it like just shake. Give it give it some shakes. Yeah, good. I think that's fine. Great, great job. And we'll rotate it down downwards first. Yeah, and then you can oh push it in first and then Yeah. Wait no, push it all the way in. Yeah, and there you go. And then like snap the thing back down. On top. Like press so you got that right, upright. I get it and then upright. Snap that in. Woo! there and it's in position and now your thing is totally clean I mean and you can in re reinsert that mirror part this over here this yeah well no I don't, don't reinsert that yet I think because it's probably it dries better if that's not in there well we I have mean, to run more we have to run hot water into it now because to drain the urnex wait seriously yeah you gotta do two what the fuck I've never done that <laughs> I've been poisoning the customers <laughs> this takes like twice the time that it needs to what the fuck I know this shouldn't be clean with Urnex because apparently it doesn't need Urnex. Um, From now on, don't jury, use Urnex on the new ones. The jury's out. The jury's out, but we're gonna not kill people. What? I do a half batch, I guess. Right? That should be fine. That's crazy. Alright. I've been serving Urnex to customers all. Pizza party? Pizza party? I also made an instructional on pizza, and I'm gonna send it around. Like, oh, wait, can I, I'm gonna do it right now. You wanna drop it there? What's the instructional on pizza? I'll show. I'm gonna send it around. Okay. Okay. What's gonna send it? This instructional video that RJ's in the middle. Not, not just this one. Well, there's one on pizza too. There's one on pizza. This one is. Also, why are there no, why are there no okay, ice packs so underneath of this? Oh, seriously? Fuck. Oops. I don't understand, why don't they just put molasses in here? Wouldn't that be so cool? There were literally like molasses, like these were like crystallized in molasses. That'd be dope. That'd be so good. I don't know if it would be any good, but it sounds cool. <laughs> Alright, anyway, after this, you just insert the glass piece, and you put this, you slide this back in. Mm -hmm. Well, I don't know about this piece, yeah, I'm sure you do that. And then this, you wash this out, rinse it. Like get all that coffee out of there, so it doesn't sit in there and rot. And then, um, and then uh, slide it back in, and also make sure to slide back in that glass, like fender. I mean, not glass, the clear. It's not glass. It's just clear plastic fender. And then you're set. Then you're then you've got it. All right. Great job, Cobb.